To ensure that Stuart gets the perfect Prague night out, Mark has hired a guide called Mike, who knows the best places to go in the city. We're going to have a really lovely time in this um, great restaurant by the Charles Bridge, right next to the river. Um, it's one of the restaurants with the, with the best uh, cuisine, you know, international food and like big steaks, uh, lots of drinks, Czech beer, of course, and. Uh, of course, there's a bit of a surprise coming later on for the stack, so he's going to have a good night, and I am sure that we all will. <laughs> for eight years, activities for the weekend invaders have been organised by Mark Robinson. He has seen everything. I've seen them dressed up in the boat suits and whatnot, but the worst one, and I wouldn't encourage it, I've seen a guy, they stuck him to a local shop window with super glue and pulled down his pants, and he was quite pissed, so in the morning... <laughs> The only people that could help him were the shoppers looking at him. The law, they don't take any crap. I mean, you can't drink in Prague in public, which we, it's easy in England. You buy a can, you have a drink. Here, they don't, they don't like it. There are on-the-spot fines. If you're jaywalking or there, there's certain things, I mean, you can smoke here in, in the pubs, you can smoke in the street, but you can't smoke in public places. The police see that, they'll charge you. If they see you drunk on the town, they'll find you there, there and then on the spot. It's not like back at home where you might get a step on the wrist and maybe a caution. <laughs> <laughs>